This is the Sony HTX8500. No, 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 I didn't memorize that. I just read off the box. But once again, we go down into that, that strange world where companies continue to have jargon-filled alphabets and numbers to make up a name. You know, if this had something like maybe Thunder or Roar, I mean, those are very generic, but you know, Sony, you can come up with much better ones. People would remember this. And just as proof of concept, let's try this small little game, okay? Tell me, what is the name? of this soundbar, and I just told you a few seconds back. Now, I'm sure 99% of you cannot tell me the name, that 1% that do, amazing, but then you must be part of Sony. So what really happens with something like this is great product. I mean, if I read off the box again, Dolby Atmos, Dolby Vision, uh, vertical surround engine, does a lot of stuff that is quite amazing. But once again, difficult for you to remember. You'll see it on the show. You'll go to the showroom and you'll be like, I saw it there with that, on that show with Rajiv, but I can't remember the name. So Sony, you're really missing out on some stuff. But of course, like I said, the product is amazing and Priyanka has the story. One, two, three. Hang on, I'm not exercising because this in fact is too light for me to be using this even as a dumbbell. This happens to be a new soundbar from Sony and yes Rajiv, you are right. It is a bit of a mouthful but I have managed to learn the name. This is the Sony soundbar HTX8500. But dear Sony, I'm giving this a new name. I'm calling it the buddy. Why? Because this is going to be your best buddy especially with the World Cup season underway. This soundbar weighs only about 3 kilos and it happens to be one of the lighter soundbars that I've come across in the market currently. It comes with a unique surround vertical engine. Now how does that work? I'm not really sure but I'm going to try and decode the technology and show you if this in fact adds to your TV viewing experience in any which way. With the World Cup underway, I think this is a great gifting option. But first, let's dive into the features. A great TV without a great soundbar is like the perfect dish without good seasoning. Okay, okay, food metaphors aside, the need for good affordable soundbars is now more than ever, which is why we mostly suggest you buy an audio system separately to make the most of a new TV. And Sony is aiming to fulfill this gap in the market with the HTX8500 soundbar, which is priced at Rs 29,990. It comes with all the frills, a built-in subwoofer, Dolby Atmos sound, a virtual 7.1.2 channel surround sound and Bluetooth 4.2 connectivity. There is no spaghetti of cables and you can simply plug in the power cord and connect via the HDMI port or using Bluetooth. We like the compact form factor and the fact that it is a narrow slab instead of a bulky setup which may be too intimidating for the uninitiated. And now let's listen to the sound. Just before gravity takes hold, scattering chaos to the four corners of the room. We played a few tracks and were suitably impressed, though not overwhelmed and it's evident that a more expensive one will offer a better output. The soundbar is not for a very large room and would work better for smaller setups. Usually soundbar or normal speaker, TV speaker, it's just a flat surround. But this one, thanks to our engineer's effort, we can create the vertical sound position, surround experience. That is the uniqueness of this product. All in all, the surround sound plays pretty well on the soundbar and it works well for the segment and target audience that it is intended for. You can spend lakhs on a soundbar or opt for one of these. So what do we think? So that was the soundbar from Sony. I'm still calling it the buddy because I have been enjoying the audio output from it for a while now and I have to say for a soundbar this size, the output was pretty phenomenal. So with the World Cup season underway, if you're someone who's feeling very generous and wants to give somebody a soundbar, I think this is a great option. It's compact, there is no spaghetti or wires, it is so easy to connect. So I can't wait to enjoy the next few matches using the soundbar.